I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Have a moment of silence, please. Amen. Thank you. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. All right. We'll open with, with public comment on the agenda or non-agenda items. Right. Yes, Stacy. Um, can I have? Um, I'd like to ask about for a little background on. Motion number seven on the agenda is the dissolution of the rail authority. Yep. Um, like, how did this come about? It, I know it had been talked about for, for years, whether it was a possibility or not a possibility. And well, right so. now it's an inactive authority. Um, there are no current members that are on the authority right mm -hmm. now. So I'm reviewing with people that were on the authority before. Uh, no one seems to feel that there is a need to have the authority anymore. There's a discussion on having a committee, possibly. Because we have that uh, multimodal project that... Right, and that's a private entity. Yes. So authority would only be as if you're going to do a public right. project. And it's private, so so after I think what what is it, uh, thirteen or seventeen years, and it's decided that there are no active members. Yeah. There and it's an inactive group, so it's time to just dissolve it and take care of it. And not that they don't meet, as Commissioner Herschel said. Uh, the members that were on it, <clears throat> a lot of them are still meeting. So to keep that avenue open, uh, we are looking to have them as a subcommittee under the Progress Authority, which is still an authority, um, to be a subcommittee under them. They only meet like three times a year. There's three members to the board. Right. Because mm -hmm. I know like, they, they were instrumental in, in meeting with um, Northeast Freight and, and or. I they have met with them or, I don't know. It's our understanding there hasn't been a whole there's lot of contact right. um, regularly within the last several years. I know, yeah. you know, yeah. Ken was, yeah. anyway, yeah. and that's what I mean. Okay. All right. <coughs> oh, yes. Let's see. We have, we also have on the... On the agenda, the collective bargaining agreements for the court-related and the Jail. Teamsters mm -hmm. and residual. residual and the non-bargaining unit position. Mm -hmm. Right. No, I thought some of these were already. No. Mm -hmm. The only no, one that was no. done already was the okay. uh, the uh, Pro probation and children and youth. Probation and yeah. children and youth weren't up this year. Um, they were already done two years ago. The only one, the other one was the uh, <coughs> court, um, 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 the court appointed was done at the oh, last that's meeting. that's right, court appointed. <coughs> All right, so um, if you could just maybe go through some of these, uh, are there any significant changes to any of them? Well, yeah, there's, yeah. Um, <coughs> you know, there's increases um, in there, of course, uh, most of them run about 3%. Um, and there are some uh, salary adjustments for individuals that are um, way far below uh, the uh, market average. Uh, but the uh, does that include the sheriff's department? Yes, it does. The deputies? Yeah, oh, absolutely. Yeah. It includes everybody, not everybody. just the sheriff's department, because they're although everybody may think they're special, everybody's special. Corrections so. officers, everyone. Yeah. <coughs> so, um, what kind of what kind of salary adjustments are you looking at? Like, or, well, I think, you know, I think when you look at it, you know, everything works on proportion, skill level, and, and accountability and responsibility. But, you know, when I started here in 2012, we had start rates still at $4.70. Of course, we weren't using them. 
but now I think right. our lowest start rate is uh, 12 something. Stacy, so the county had done a salary study starting in, I believe, 18 <coughs> and it wrapped up in 19. So a lot of that is based on um, numbers from surrounding counties, comparable counties. So we did use that as a reference. There was a low, median, and then high range, you know, that was off. And hopefully with what's going on in the world today, we'll still be able to hire people, even though everybody in town has a help wanted sign up and nobody seems to be able to hire anybody. Somebody else can ask a question while I just double check. And, um, and you don't have to do it now, maybe you'll be doing it at the end of the meeting, but an update on, we haven't had an update like a real cohesive update on the uh, public safety facility in a, in a while. It's coming along beautifully. So, yeah, so we're looking prime mid-September. Okay. I mean, the last, like, I think the last time we updated it was back in January, February, and but the weather has not been extraordinary. The weather has not been very really lost three months <laughs> because of the snow. Because, like, mean, you, your target then was June yeah. was yeah. the last target. Right. And I'm like, hmm. Yeah, it got pushed off a little bit because yeah. of the weather. Side, siding is going on the outside. Brickwork's being done on the front. Concrete's been poured. Um, the center block walls are all going up. Sheetrocking has started. Duct work is in. Much of it. Mm -hmm. A lot. It's going fast now. Uh, I think that's that's pretty much all I think I have on the, the uh, commissioners' meeting. Very good. Get a motion. Anybody else? Anybody else have any questions? Okay. Motion to close public comment. I will second that motion. Motion by Commissioner Hall, second by Commissioner Hensel to close public comment at 9:07. All in favor say aye. 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 Motion to approve the minutes of the April 28th meeting. I'll second that. Motion by Commissioner Hall, approved by, uh, seconded by Commissioner Herschel to approve the minutes of the April 28th, 2021 meeting. All in favor say aye. 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 Motion to recess commissioners meeting and open the salary board. I'll second that. Motion by Commissioner Hall, seconded by Commissioner Herschel to close the commissioners meeting and open recess. the salary board. And recess. Recess. Sorry. Recess the commissioners meeting and open the salary board at 9.07. All in favor say aye. 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 I haven't had recess in a lot of years. It's been a lot of years since I've had recess. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a lot more for me, so. <laughs> This is true. That's true. Can we get a recess? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> All right. right. We'll call the commission, uh, salary board meeting to order at 9.07. I've had more timeouts than recesses. Ah, I, I, bet bet did. Did. I bet you did. <laughs> Any public comment on the agenda? Or did we answer it in the last meeting? Pretty much answered in the last meeting. The one thing we did not, um, I didn't ask about in the last meeting, so I'll do it here since it's on this agenda, is pay increases for non-bargaining unit employees. So it's the same. So this is just going to handle all of like the increases for your your non-union salary. All the confidential uh, directors, managers, supervisors. ones that are not part of a bargaining unit. Is there any time in the future, this sort of salary board, this would be salary board related, any time in the future, um, because you are bringing employee salaries up to, to date with current standards, but salary, or the uh, salary for elected officials is, mm -hmm. is lagging. Well, uh, and I don't think you were at the last meeting where we had. Yeah, uh, you weren't. We set the salaries for the elected officials, so that was that gets set every um, December. Every four years, right? Or every two years, something like that. I can't mm -hmm. remember, but we do it in December. It's a me evening meeting. Mm -hmm. uh, the last one we did do an increase for the uh, elected officials. The law is very specific in that you mm -hmm. cannot change the salary of an elected official in the year that they're in office. Right. You have to set it the year before they run for office. Mm -hmm. So whatever is cast in stone is cast in stone. And all the elected officials, according to the law, are, except for the coroner, um, are supposed to be paid the same. Mm -hmm. Right. Yep. 
but there still wasn't much of an increase at that. Compared to other counties? Um, it's, it's comparable to other counties? It's comparable. Okay. We're not on the high end, we're not on the low end, we're, we're on a little bit just below the median right now. For a class six. For a mm -hmm. class six. I mean, you know, it's public service. We don't do it for money, we do it just for the sheer pleasure of being mm -hmm. here. For the love of it. <laughs> I will reserve my comments. I can only say that because it's not raining or there's no thunderstorms over here. I will get struck by lightning, you know? So. I'm not here to judge your motivations. <laughs> Alright. You good? Yeah. Alright. Motion closed public comment. I'll second that. Motion by Commissioner Hall, second by Commissioner Herschel, closed public comment. <clears throat> All in favor say aye. 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 Motion approved by item one, two. I'll second that. Motion by Commissioner Hall to approve the minutes of the April 28th, 2021 salary board meeting. Seconded by Commissioner Herschel. All in favor say aye. 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 Motion to approve item three. I'll second that. Motion by Commissioner Hall to ratify and approve <coughs> the collective bargaining agreement between Southern Anna <coughs> County and the Teamsters Local 229 covering the court related bargaining unit effective January 1st, 2021 through December 31st, 2024. Per the recommendation of the commissioner, seconded by Commissioner Herschel, all in favor say aye. 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 Motion approve item four. I'll second that. <coughs> Motion by Commissioner Hall to ratify and approve the collective <coughs> bargaining agreement between Susquehanna County and Teamsters Union 229 covering the residual bargaining unit effective January 1st, 2021 through December 31st. 2024, per the recommendation of the commissioners, seconded by Commissioner Herschel. All in favor say aye. 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 Motion approved five. I'll second that. Motion by Commissioner Hall to ratify and approve the collective <coughs> bargaining agreement between Susquehanna County and Teamsters Local 229, covering the jail bargaining unit, effective January 2021 through December 2024, per the recommendation of the commissioners. All in favor say aye. 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 Uh, item six, I'll make a motion with a couple changes. Uh, I should say to ratify and approve the pay plan increases for the non-bargaining unit uh, employees, effective January 1st, 2021, including the escalation of the start rates per year. Including the escalation? Yep. Escalation. I'll second that with the change made to the pay plan, including the escalation of salaries. And so I can explain that to people what that means is all our contracts now, part of the problem the county has is uh, the start rates were stagnant in the county, so that's why I say that when I came in, start rates were still at $4.70 an hour. Uh, so basically what we did through the salary analysis was we um, determined what the new start rates are and basically what happens with all the contracts and union contracts have it in it, so I didn't have to state it there. But all the contracts, the start rates increase one quarter or 1% each year so that they're not stagnant and they continue to move so that we don't end up into this problem again. Okay, all in favor say aye. 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 Make a motion to close the meeting. I'll second that. Commissioner Hall makes a motion to close the salary board meeting at 913, seconded by Commissioner Herschel. All in favor say aye. 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 The meeting closes at 9.13. Thank you. I'll make a motion to approve item four on the commissioner's meeting. I will second that. A motion by Commissioner Hall to ratify and approve the following expenses. Seconded by, these are just the monthly bills. Um, seconded by Commissioner Herschel. All in favor say aye. 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 Motion to approve item five. I'll second that. Motion by Commissioner Hall to approve the following seminar and travel requests. Um, we have different departments. Uh, some of these are physical and some of them are virtual trainings. Uh, seconded by Commissioner Herschel. All in favor say aye. 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 Make a motion to approve item six. I'll second that. Motion by Commissioner Hall to approve and sign the 2021 Susquehanna County Local Emergency Planning Committee bylaws. Seconded by Commissioner Herschel. All in favor say aye. 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 Motion to approve item seven. I'll second that. I have a motion by Commissioner Hall to sign a resolution to dissolve the Susquehanna County Rail Authority. The resolution and paperwork will be filed with the Pennsylvania Department of State as required. Seconded by Commissioner Herschel. All in favor say aye. Aye. 
And I'm going to do a nay on that one. Number Make eight. A motion approve number eight. I'll second that. I have a motion by Commissioner Hall to approve a change order for Geoscience Engineering and Testing LLC, Jessup PA, in the amount of $17,000 for the new public safety building. Seconded by Commissioner Herschel. All in favor say aye. 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 I'll make a motion to approve item 9. I'll second that. I have a motion by Commissioner Hall to approve entering into an agreement with Malenko Inc., Kingsley PA, for the purchase of 10 signs depicting Susquehanna <coughs> County as a Purple Heart County for use at various entry points in the county at a total cost of $2,000. Seconded by Commissioner Herschel. All in favor say aye. Aye. Motion to approve item 10. I'll second that. Motion by Commissioner Hall to ratify and approve the collective bargaining agreement between Susquehanna County and Teamsters Local 229 covering the court-related bargaining unit effective January 2021 through December 31st, 2024 per the recommendation of the commissioners. All in favor say aye. 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 Motion to approve 11. I'll second that. Motion by Commissioner Hall to ratify and approve the collective bargaining <coughs> agreement between Susquehanna County Teamsters 229 covering the residual bargaining unit effective January 1st, 2021 through December 31st, 2024 per the recommendation of the commissioners. All in favor say aye. 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 Motion approved 12. I'll second that. Motion by Commissioner Hall to ratify and approve the collective bargaining agreement between Susquehanna County and the Teamsters Local 229 covering the jail bargaining unit cover effective January 1st, 2021 through December 31st, 2024 per the recommendation of the commissioners. All in favor say aye. 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 Motion approved 13. I'll second that. I have a motion by Commissioner Hall to ratify and approve the pay increases for the non bargaining unit employees effective January 1st, 2021. Seconded by Commissioner Herschel. And we'll make the changes like we did in the yes, other. Yes, I'll correct my motion to include those changes. Good I, I will second that. With those changes, yeah. okay. All in favor say aye. 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 Motion approved 14. I will second that. Motion by Commissioner Hall to accept with regret the resignation of Karen Van Eaton from the position of full-time case aid, effective May 19th, 2021, per Michelle Graziano, Director of Children and Youth Services. Seconded by Commissioner Herschel. All in favor say aye. 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 Motion approved 15. I'll second that. A motion by Commissioner Hall to acknowledge the hiring of Wendy Carey Montrose to the open full-time union eligible position of de Domestic Relations Establishment Specialist Court Liaison at $14.42 per hour, 40 hours a week. Per the recommendation of President Judge Jason Lake. Seconded by Commissioner Herschel. All in favor say aye. 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 Is that the new rate, Rebecca, or don't you know? I believe it is. Okay. Mm -hmm. Motion approved 16. I will second that. Motion by Commissioner Hall to ratify and accept the termination of Tina Polchik from the position of part time corrections officer effective May 5th, 2021, per Warden Bruce Hall. Seconded by Commissioner Herschel. All in favor say aye. 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 Motion approved 17. I will second that. Motion by Commissioner Hall to approve the transfer of John Jan Greco from the position of part time corrections officer to the open union eligible position of full time <coughs> corrections officer at 1635 per hour, effective June 1st, 2021, with a six month probationary period and benefits according to the jail bargaining unit. Per the recommendation of Warden Bruce Hall, seconded by Commissioner Herschel. All in favor say aye. 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 <coughs> Motion to approve 18. I will second that. Motion by Commissioner Hall to accept with regret the resignation of Jonathan Terry from the position of full-time 9-11 systems and public safety building IT technician. Effective May 20th, 2021, per the recommendation of Bradley Ellsworth and Stephen Janowski. Seconded by Commissioner Herschel. All in favor say aye. 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 Motion to approve 19. I'll second that. A motion by Commissioner Hall to approve hiring Clayton Whitney of New Milford to the open part-time union eligible position of corrections officer at 1635 per hour. Seconded um, for the recommendation of Warden Bruce Hall. Seconded by Commissioner Herschel. All in favor say aye. 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 Motion approved 20. I'll second that. Motion by Commissioner Hall to approve proclamation 2021-19 proclaiming May 16th to the 22nd, 2021 as emergency medical services week. Um, seconded by Commissioner Herschel, and I would just like to say on behalf of the commissioners, we thank all of the people, um, first responders and um, everyone that this involves, our emergency medical people. We thank you and um, just thank you for all your service to our county and to our community and your sacrifices that we know that you do. Thank you so much. All in favor say aye. 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 Much closed meeting. I'll second that. Motion by Commissioner Hall to close the meeting at 919. Seconded by Commissioner Mitchell. All in favor say aye. 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 aye.